LRBAquatics.com. Hello, world. How's it going? Coming to you live once again. And today, I'm going to share with you some new goodies I brought back from the Greater Chicago Cichlid Association Swap. Which, if you guys haven't seen the video that I did before this video, I showed all of, well, not all of, but a bit about what the swap was about. And also, today, I want to share with you just some random fish stuff, because, hey, why not? This is a fish channel, and these rainbows are looking really good. So I figured I'd give you some gratuitous rainbow fish footage. Yeah, the uh, glass is a little dirty, but, I mean, you'll have that. They're healthy, they're happy, they don't mind a dirty tank. That side's really uh, busting up with some plants. But yes, let, let me flip you guys over so you can better see these guys. I just, I, I'll never get tired of this tank. I absolutely love this tank and these rainbow fish. Uh, Glossolepis uh, Snapper Creek. Um, this is a uh, Dorotei, Glossolepis Dorotei. Uh, Melanotania goldii to Kai, Upper Tor River species, Melanotania. And let's see what else is in here. We got Melanotania bowmani back here, Melanotania cali rum. There's the bowmani. You can see them a lot better. And Bob Kaler, yes, I can show you your babies real quick. Still working on getting those shipped out. It's been crazy. I'm actually waiting on getting boxes from USPS. They've been dropping the ball. I guess my girlfriend ordered boxes a long time ago and still haven't came in. I ordered some as well. Still waiting on them. But even my regular shipping boxes, I haven't been able to get. I don't know what the heck's going on. So I got so much I'm dealing with, plus aquatic experiences coming. But I am working on it. I got the oxygen at least. I need to go to the store actually. I'm planning on doing that tomorrow to get a regulator. Hopefully Walmart has something or somewhere. Some people have linked it up. But I don't want to wait for shipping. I do want to get them out this week. But here are the uh, Goldie Eye Kai as well. The ones we are talking about. Well you can see they don't have as much color as they would. Because they're actually on light substrate. If they had dark substrate, they would be popping a lot more. So think about that with your fish. Some fish, it doesn't matter. Like these Cynodonis lucipennis over here. They don't care. Oh, wow. That is littered with eggs. Look in that bowl. All that white stuff. Those are all lucipennis eggs. Tons and tons of them. These rainbows must be a good dither for these guys. Dun, 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 dun. Cool, cool. I'm gonna have to, I may try collecting those eggs and just stick them in one of the fry containers. Look at that Cali rum. I am gonna be bringing some Cali rums. It's a uh, Melanotania from uh, Cali rum, unnamed species. Super rare in the hobby. When the male gets in breed mode, he gets like this blue, kind of like light blue on top of his forehead. The male in here is actually the king alpha fish of the whole tank. And the one that gets to breed the most. But nothing comes of it because they're in a community. You don't want a hybrid fish with rainbows. I am going to bring a small group of those. Look at that bow man eye. Ooh, there's Cali Rum. Another one, Upper Tour. Bow man eye. Goldie Eye and Kai. They're just showing off now. What's the purplish one? I'm not sure what you're talking about. I know the uh, Goldie Eye and Kai has that, but this has a little purplish, the bow man eye. This purplish, I don't know, it's more of a bluish. That's the Goldie Eye. And the Snapper Creek. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I love this tank. It's always fun to feed them too. I know I do this every now and then on live streams, but 
It never gets old. It never gets old. I threw a bunch in there. I should have only threw a little bit in there. Teased them a little bit. They'll eat it all. But hello, everybody in the chat. Thanks uh, for hanging out. And I got an unboxing to do, too. So let's do that. See what we got in the box, what I brought back from the GCCA swap. Towels, towels, more towels. I sold pretty much everything besides like a few plants and my snowball and some uh, snowball shrimp. And I ended up getting more shrimp. I, I wasn't planning on getting any shrimp. I thought about discus, but I want to wait until I'm able to keep these smaller ones better too. Since I've been fighting ick in those and um, already lost a couple from that ick. But in here, they're really kind of hard to see what they are. Almost look like cherry shrimp, but they're not cherry shrimp. These are actually Cardinal Swayze shrimp, which is a shrimp I've been wanting to get for quite some time. And the guy was home breeding them in Chicago. Um, I think it's Chicago goldfish. I think he does goldfish as well. And he said he's been home breeding them, so... That's cool. Oh no, there's one down. I gotta get these guys out of the bag. I have no idea where I'm gonna put them whatsoever. So I was not planning on it. I also got some rabbit snails from Jonathan from Michigan. I think Killy's his name. We got a black rose shrimp. He just gave these to me. I wasn't even. I was looking at them and I was debating them because I've been kind of wanting the ones with like the red in them and uh, these didn't have the red in them but they still look good and he just hooked me up with them. I didn't really have any place to put them either. I have no idea where I'm going to put these shrimp. That's kind of why they're still in here. I do got to take care of it. What's up Wesley? How you doing bud? Yeah. You just get a bath? Yeah. All right. Then we got more rabbit snails. Wow. And that's it. Then my snowballs that I took. That's what's left. Then Wesley made it. All right, you got your fish stuff on. Look at that. I got fish yeah, pajamas. I'm making a pillow, see? Sweet. Awesome. Good. I also brought this tank out of storage, and I'm planning on throwing some uh, thread fin water lettuce in that and maybe getting some babies out of that or maybe use it for random breeding what is so funny? it is so funny look at these fish through this oh this bitch look so at cool. that follow me follow you like this oh you like these fish yeah you like these guys huh yeah that's maybe. pretty cool yeah big one you and me and daddy. Yeah, they eat well, don't they? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he don't have some food anywhere. Yeah. Have Let's go show them the baby bettas. Okay. Give them a little update on the baby bettas. Yeah. What do you guys think? And these Nemos, they need to, uh, we need to put this daddy fish with this mommy fish. Yeah. Where? Panda betta, these endo purple and regular panda. There you go, focus in there. They're uh, all over the place swimming around. And if you see here on these tags, starting to fill it up quite a bit. Nothing there, but boom, these are all bettas. All tagged. All tagged. All tagged. Nothing up on top yet because I just haven't wanted to go up there. Fishy Mailman, thank you so much for that $5 super chat. Really appreciate that. It says, Wesley's always the star of the show. Hopefully his camera work is getting close to Jimmy's LOL. He's been working on it. Look, he's got the camera running. Show him you got the camera running there. Yeah. Right here, see that? 
Yeah, he's working on it. He's yeah, practicing. Yeah, we want him to take a video. Yeah, and uh, Bob. Now fish and shrimp. With fish and shrimp, yep. All right, Bob Kaler, thank you so much for the $15 Super Chat. Super appreciate that. Says, love those Snapper Creek rainbows. I'll have to research them. Are they rare? Don't think I've seen them before. Wesley knows good fish, LOL. Um, they're somewhat rare. They're not like super rare like the Goldie Eye to Kai, but um, they can be hard to find in most places. But they are definitely beautiful. They're the Snapper Creek Doble Eye. Melanitania Doble Eye. And that would be D O U. B L A Y I. Come on. Easy up, yeah, knucklehead. Yeah. I'll get you. I get you. Ow! Right in the <laughs> eye. My <laughs> <Thank> goodness. <laughs> hey, now. Don't make me submit you on TV. Deuce. He's a wild child. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm gonna hop off here before he gets too crazy. Hey, that's not nice. Let's not do that. Get yourself in trouble. All right, hope you guys all have a good one. And let me know, I was thinking about going through this fry rack and uh, showing you guys what all I got in there in another video. So let me know if you guys wanna see that in the comments. And uh, yeah, till next time, everybody. Peace, can you say peace? Peace. Like and subscribe. Don't forget to share. Yeah. All right. Good job. We'll see you guys later.